This is an update video just to let you know what is happening with Mac University membership and basically all the courses that I've been promising you and the live shows. So to start things off, the first thing that I was having problems with is the domain name. Uh, so I was having some legal issues with that. So I had to let the domain name go. So eventually I had to choose a different domain and now it's called Funnels to Income. For, so for those of you that have been visiting the website, you might have noticed that the domain name has changed and it's now called Funnels to Income. So that came in with a lot of work. I had to redirect everything. I had to set up quite a lot of things to make the old content on the old domain work with the new domain. Now, as if my problems were enough, <laughs> um, I started off with MemberPress as my membership plugin for this website. Now, I had some serious issues with that because of the way I was trying to implement it. Then I moved on to using WP Fusion alone as the, uh, the membership plugin. And that, again, was giving me a lot of problems because I'd moved to a payment gateway, um, which is uh, WooCommerce. So apparently, if you're trying to create a membership website, you have to be aware of what works together and what causes a lot of conflict. So in my case, it was more of, okay, I know this plugin is solid, so it should work, and I applied it. So this ended up putting a lot of pressure on me because a lot of things are not working. One of the worst things that I really dread is people that are on the monthly membership sending me emails saying they can't access their, their content. Because to be fair, you're paying for that content, so you should get access to it. So if you're not getting access to it, it is on me. So that really, really stresses me a lot. So in the journey to find the actual uh, system that actually works, I had to uh, settle to settle down to a plugin called Woo Memberships and Woo Subscriptions because that really, really works well with WooCommerce because WooCommerce, WooCommerce now is what I use as my payment gateway. So this is where we are right now. So if you are still getting problems um, accessing your courses, please let me know. Uh, now I can easily go in and... Uh, just reset the access and you should have no problems with that. Now, while we're on that note, if you want to get in touch with me and if there's something wrong, via email is not really a good idea because I get quite a lot of spam and I get quite a lot of emails. So if there's any issues that you need to address or something is, is, is not right, if you go to um, funnels to income.com, on the bottom right, there's a blue icon. That's the support icon. If you click on that, um, I'll be able to um, to support you much better that way because via email, it doesn't really uh, work. It's, it's hit and miss, to be honest. And sometimes I don't even get the emails. So this is the best way to actually, you know, provide support for you. Okay, now move on, uh, moving on. The other thing that I was also working on on the website and um, which is what caused a lot of delays in me producing a lot of content and also having the, uh, the weekly live workshops is I moved the old um, LearnDash system to the brand new uh, LearnDash 3.0, which to be honest is a much, 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 much better system. In fact, let me just do, you a, uh, let me just do a quick demo and just show you how it looks like. Now, for those of you that haven't logged into your membership, if you log in, this is what you'll now see. This is a now much better dashboard. So here you can see all your courses that you're signed up to. And over here, you can also see your progress as to you know how well you're doing. If you, if you come over here on my progress, this is where you would see how much you've done so far, how many steps you've taken in each and every course. So as you can see here, on uh, the WordPress Gutenberg Mastery, I've uh, done two out of 14 steps. So pretty much I've watched, you know, two videos. Okay, so uh, I also have this special offers. So if there's anything coming up and there's a special offer, this is now available, available in your dashboard. And over here, I have upcoming courses. Again, I'll be updating this, letting you know what is coming up. Now, let me just show you quickly what the new interface looks like. And I'm sure if you, if you recall what we used to have before compared to what we have now, there's a massive difference. And I think this is much, much better. So if I click here on a course, I mean on a lesson, sorry, it takes us to a brand new interface. Now, here is the course landing page. But if I go to my lesson, notice uh, the interface now. This is definitely much different and it's much, much better than what we had before. So it's cleaner 
As you can see here, we have this progress at the top. We also have this mock as complete. And over here, this is where we have the lessons. Now, the good thing about this interface is you can also collapse this and get more real estate on your videos. So you can actually watch this in full screen if you want to. And then on the bottom here, you can also mark as complete. And then if you wanna bring it back, you can just click on that and then this comes back. Now this is called focus mode and this is from Learn Dash 3.0. I've done quite a few videos about it. So um, uh, if you haven't watched the YouTube videos, please go and check it out. Now, if you wanna go back to your course homepage, you can just click here, click course home and this will take you back to your homepage. So this is the update that I was also working on to really make the membership function correctly and also give you a better uh, experience. Now, this view that I've just shown you, it also works for those of you who have the free membership, which is the uh, free WordPress course. You still get that, um, that layout of, um, of the uh, learning experience. And this is called focus mode. Right, so let's move on to the next thing, and I think this is also very, very important. I've introduced something here called Upcoming. Now, this is going to be the roadmap, uh, pretty much giving you, giving you an idea of what courses are coming up, what is happening, and so on. So I have a timeline. So here we can see Saturday Live Workshop resumes. So this is going to be next Saturday, same time, uh, and it's, uh, it's going to be July the 27th. And this is where we'll be just pretty much covering, you know, what we used to do before, the um, latest topics. We can also cover advanced topics, Q&As, and all that good stuff. So that's coming back. And this is only accessible to members only. And then over here, I have the Cotflow's Mastery course. That's coming up shortly as well. In fact, I think I got the date wrong here. I might need to go back and fix this. Uh, and then the course after that is Learn Dish Mastery. And then we have a shop which is going to launch. Now, what's going to happen with the shop is I was experimenting with some layouts and I realized that quite a lot of you really, really love the, uh, the layouts, which you can just drag and drop and then just start working on that. So there's some sales funnels uh, templates that I created. And yes, quite a few of you really, really enjoyed it. So what I'm going to do is I am going to continue creating these sales pages. So for those of you that want to create landing pages for your clients, or if you're a freelance designer, you want to create some landing pages, sales pages, I'll be um, selling these on the website. But if you're a member, these are 100% free. You can just go in and download them for free. Okay, um, later on in, the, uh, in October, I'm also going to introduce a live Wednesday. Now, this is going to be purely a Q&A, and mainly I'm going to have this on YouTube and Facebook because I want to give uh, the opportunity of those that haven't become members yet to ask their questions if they need to and so on. And moving on, and this is the big one, Divi Blueprint 4. Now, this Divi Blueprint 4 course is going to be a massive course. And this is pretty much going to cover quite a lot. It's going to be intensive. I'm also going to be covering, you know, things like design principles, branding, SEO, e-commerce, memberships, and more. So it's not just going to be a Divi itself. So I might change the title, but of course, the core of the, whatever is going to be happening in design is going to be based on Divi. So I'm not sure if this is going to be the title, but... Around October, you are going to get a fully fledged course. And again, if you're a member, uh, whether you're a lifetime member or you're a monthly member, you are going to be getting access to this course absolutely free. And for those of you who are monthly members, uh, you have it free as long as your membership is active. Now, if you're not a member, this course is going to be costing around probably six ninety seven because, as I mentioned, it's going to be very, very intensive. Now, the reason why I say that is because Elegant Themes is working on the latest features of Divi, and these features are header and footer, uh, theme customizer, or oh, template builder, sorry, and uh, all these features are huge they are they're going to need a lot of um, a lot of work a lot of training and a lot of know-how so this is what i'll be covering as much as i can and also showing you how to apply this in real life situations so this is the big one which i'm really looking forward to launching uh, around october now the reason why this i say around october is because the course is going to depend on 
how soon these features are released. For those of you that have been waiting, uh, you know, for for all these features, you know that uh, it's taken quite a while for these for these features to be released. And also talking about WooCommerce, there's going to be a major update um, with DV4, which is going to make the building of WooCommerce product pages much much easier. So this is really really exciting stuff. Right. So moving on. I've spoken about the uh, updated dashboard and I've also spoken about the support. Now, when I come over here to support, you'll notice that um, we can right away send some messages. You can attach files. You can attach, um, you know, pretty much anything that you want here. I manage this much, much easier. I know it's not 100%. I'm really, really doing my best to make this work. And in fact, to be honest, I've been sleeping in the office, <laughs> working on this website to make sure it doesn't, you know, it doesn't break apart. So I am really trying my best to make this work. So thank you very much for your patience. You are going to be seeing a lot of exciting stuff. The idea with this membership is I don't want to be spending time with the design of the website and... Um, the conflicts of the website. I really want the website to work and just do its job, allow people to access it and allow people to, you know, uh, use it as it's supposed to. But I want to be spending 99% of my time creating content and helping you guys out. This is the, uh, the dream I have for this membership website. All right, so that's all I have. If you have any questions, please, please, Ask me your questions in the comments box below and I'll do my best to respond just in case I haven't covered, you know, something that's, uh, you know, that's very, very important in this regard. Or if something that's really bothering you that you haven't really asked, please ask me in the comments box below. But I'm really looking forward to bringing the uh, live show back. I really enjoy it and also creating new courses. So if you haven't logged in, uh, try your membership, log in and see if everything is working okay. If not, right away, come over here to the support tab and send me, an, uh, send me a message and then I'll be able to take a look at it for you. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.